All right, guys, it's been a little bit, but it's update time. Um, I did get my rear rotor guard in from Hess Motorsports. So I'm going to be putting that on pretty soon. I want to go ahead and put the rest of my rear end on my other hub, stuff like that. So my anti-fade lock nut. Tonight I've been working on the handlebars, uh, trying to get everything mounted on them. I got it all mounted for now. Once I get it on the ground where I can really get the feel and look of everything better and measure it, I may readjust some of it. But of course, ASV levers, they're not the shorties, they're the long ones. I like the long ones a little better. Got the dust covers on them. Uh, Pyramid hand guards, solid black. Of course, I went ahead and hooked my throttle cable up so I could put my throttle assembly together and I put my clutch clutch cable through the, the perch. That way I could put my dust cover on that one. So, yeah. ASV lever this side, of course. Got my throttle all put together and on there. Got it powdered illusion purple with the thumb throttle powdered black. I went with a 450R front master cylinder. The front master cylinder on this one was completely roached. I mean, it could have been fixed, but it's more trouble than it's worth. I just bought a new 450R master, and I had this uh, Max Racing master cylinder cover, so slapped it on there, brand new, with a sticker. I found it in a box of 250R parts, so. Black, purple, and billet are gonna be the colors. Very little billet, but there is gonna be some. So that's why I had it, and I thought, well, I'll just put it on there. It's kinda cool. So anyway, I'll step back here, let y'all get a look at it. It's coming together pretty good. I'm tickled with how the bar setup looks. I can't wait to get it on the ground though and actually sit on it and get a feel for it. It'll be a little bit better, I'm sure. Other than that, um, I did get my hood and my tank cover. I just went with Meyer carbon fiber, Alba gas cap. Um, of course, I put the new Honda OEM fuel screen in it. I had all my mounts powdered. Actually, I painted those and powdered this one. No grommets. Everything's going to be new. I mean, it's, except the tank, of course. It's old, but it's going to look new. And then my hood, my air carbon fiber as well. Uh, this grill, I found it on eBay. Uh, I don't like the empty holes. It just, to me, it looks tacky. So I got to looking for grills. I found this guy on eBay. He is Holt 250R, so very cool guy. Hooked me up with a black one. Uh, so if anybody wants a grill for their Meyer hood, hit him up on eBay, Holt 250R. So other than that, guys, I do have my exhaust. CT Racing mid-range exhaust. I'm gonna clean it up. It was actually on that other 87 I bought and I pulled it off. I'm gonna reuse it on this one. So, should be pretty sweet. My motor is going back together. Um, there's, I gotta have the water pump cover powdered and I had to get a different piston. Messed up and sent me the wrong piston, so. It's gonna be 66 and a half millimeter bore on it. Um, it looks, it's gonna look good. Engine's gonna look sweet. So I expect that to be done in the coming weeks. Once we get that, uh, I get some help. Cause that's gonna get some stuff a little bit over my head. This thing's really gonna start looking like a four wheeler. So, and once my shocks get done, as soon as my shocks get done, we're putting this thing on the ground. That way we can, uh, I don't know, I just, to me, it just takes away from it being up here on these, on this stand, so. Anyway, guys, that's a quick update. I did put my fuel pet cock on there. So. Got a new rubber in for the shifter. All that stuff back from powder coat, kicker, brake pedal. All that good stuff, so. All right, guys, catch you on the next one.